you are my all yes, you are and all. all. Yes, you are my my lily. Yes, oh, yes, yes. 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 All right. Thank you, Lord. You, thank you, God. Yes. My calm in the time of a storm. Thank yeah. you, Lord. Thank you. Giving honor to my Lord and Savior, yes. Jesus Christ. Yes. Yeah. Amen. And I know you always hear that all the time when anybody gets up to say anything. But when I say it, I mean it. Yeah. Because he is the head of my life. Because without him, I wouldn't be here today. Amen. To the pastor of this house, my aunt, the Reverend Louisa Thomas. Amen. And to my uncle in his absence. Brother John Thomas, let him know we're praying for him. Amen. And our prayers, his shoulder heals to be stronger than it was before he went in. Okay. Yeah, the fact that it's be as strong as it was when he was on the phone. Come on. Let him know he is in our prayers. Yes. To this choir yeah. and the musicians. Heaven, what I got to do easy. Amen. To our worship leader, yeah. we thank you for ushering the yeah. Spirit in. Yeah. 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 To the chair of the Duels Day, which I think is Sister Taylor for. Women, if I'm not mistaken, today. Yes. So I uh, thank you. Amen. And to Stuart Temple. Amen. I thank you for having me this morning. Amen. And I won't be before you long, ushers. You can take your seat. But before I go any further, let me just say this before I forget. Um, to my mom, dad. Amen. To my son. Amen. Thank you, Mr. Casanova. He's been on TV, on, on the news, and it seems like he's just getting more popular and popular. I got to tell y'all this story. He was coming home, that's a bit embarrassing now. He was coming home last night and seeing some people stranded on the road. And being a good Samaritan, he decided to stop. Well, after he saw that they had a flat tire, he called me. <laughs> <laughs> but I thank him, and if he doesn't know, I'm proud of him for the man Amen. that he is becoming. Amen. My daughter, Jasmine, that is here. My other daughter, Precious, is with her mother right now. But I thank each and every one of them. And to my wife. Amen. 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 She started giving me the introduction and I looked over to Reverend Thomas and I said, I started looking around to see who she was talking about. I thank her for her support. I thank her for being that voice of reason sometimes because even Amen. preachers need a voice of reason sometimes. Amen. Sometimes we don't want to do what the Lord say do. Yes. You know, sometimes we want to help the Lord out when mm -hmm. people talk to us in certain ways. Yes. Amen. Um, so I, I thank her for that, and I thank her for uh, just being patient with me on this road that we're, we're traveling. Because on her birthday, we're normally at annual conference, and on our anniversary, we're normally at district conferences. All right. District conference is at the end of the month, okay. this month. So I thank her for that. Let us pray. Dear gracious and eternal Father, it is now preaching time. Lord, I am your mule. You are my shepherd. These, your people, are the field. Your word is the plow. Plant your seed right now, Lord. And Lord, since you say your word will not come, in, come back to you, Lord, Lord, speak to us, speak through us. And Lord, let the words of my mouth and the meditation of my heart be acceptable in thy sight, O oh Lord, my rock and my redeemer. Amen. Amen. I prayerfully call your attention this morning to 2 Kings 6, 
chapter, starting at the 13th verse down to the 17th. 2 Kings 6 chapter, verse 13 down through the 17th. And I'm reading from the King James Version this morning. And it reads, and he said, Go and spy where he is, that I may send and fetch him. And it was told him, saying, Behold, he is in Dothan. <laughs> Not Dothan, Alabama, y'all. <laughs> Therefore, sent he there horses and chariots and a great host, and they came by night and compassed the city about. And when the servant of man, when the servant of the man of God was risen early and gone forth, behold, and host compassed the city both with horses and chariots. And his servant said unto him, At last, my master, how shall we do? And he said, Fear not, for they that be with us are more than they that be with them. And lastly, 17 says, And Elijah prayed and said, Lord, I pray thee, open his eyes yes. that he may see. Yes. And the Lord opened yes. the eyes of the young man, and he saw, and behold, the mountains were full of horses mm -hmm. and chariots of fire round about Elijah. Yes. Amen. 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 Now, our text this morning will actually come from verses 8 down. Through 23. But I'm going to focus on verse 16. And he said, and he answered, Fear not, for they that be with us are more than they that be with them. Yes. See, my brothers and sisters, when Reverend Thomas called me and asked me to preach the dual day program, I immediately went to the Lord in prayer, asking what would he have me to say? And as the weeks went by, I still didn't hear from the Lord, so I kept meditating and going into prayer. And I went into prayer with him with this stuff on my mind, our new president. Mm -hmm. you, you, you know, the mass shootings that we're having, mm -hmm. the police brutality that we're still having, mm -hmm. and the other issues that face our people on a daily basis. So I went to the Lord in prayer, and, and God spoke to me and told me to tell Stuart Temple this morning that I know you may want to give up, but don't quit. Amen. Amen. I know you want to make give. I know you may want to give up, but don't quit. In other words, when things get hard, just don't quit. Now, if we look at the background of our particular passage this morning, we see that there are three particular characters that's in this particular passage. We have the king of Syria, which is Benadad. We have the servant of Elijah. And we have Elijah himself. Now, most of us I've come to realize are like either Benadad or that servant. But all of us should strive to have the faith of Elijah. Amen. Now, now, now if, if I may, let me just lay the foundation here for a second. And, and, and I promise I, I, I won't trouble the water alone, but I will stir it a little bit. And I, 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 I promise to a temple that I, I won't be here alone. Because I always talk when you're a guest in somebody's house, you don't overstay your welcome. Mm -hmm. Because you want to come back. Yeah. I, I don't want y'all to say, well, Reverend Thomas, y'all, that's your nephew, but he just preached and stayed up there too long. I don't think we want him back no more. <laughs> so I promise I won't be before you long. But if we look at this, we see that the king of Syria was at war with Israel. Yes. And every time the king of Syria came up with a plan, you know, we, we're going to attack in this place. Uh -huh. we, we, we're going to attack them over him. It didn't work out because Elijah told the king of Israel, don't go this place. Uh -huh. Amen. Don't, don't, don't go over there because it's dangerous over there. They, they, they're waiting on you. Mm -hmm. 
So the king of Syria, Benadad, got upset. Mm. So, so, something just ain't right. Mm. So, so it, it, it can't be right. Somebody, it's a snitch mm -hmm. in my bunch. Mm -hmm. yeah. It's a Benedict Arnold somewhere. Yeah. So he, he, he called all of his people in and asked them, which one of y'all are telling our plan? Mm -hmm. Because I, I, I got this plan. I sat down and thought about it all night all right. and told only y'all in this room. Amen. Um, but what he didn't realize is just like we don't realize when we come up with these plans and don't put God first, the plan is doomed in front of your head. Amen. <laughs> in, 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 in other words, my brothers and sisters, let me put it this way. We come up with a great plan only to see it fail. We, 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 we come up with this great church service only to see the church next door got it on its marquee. All right. We, 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 we come up with this plan to make money for our nonprofit organization only to see our rivals already doing that fundraiser. But my brothers and sisters, in other words, what I'm telling you, before you talk about it, pray about it. Amen. Before you do it, make sure God approves it. Yeah. In other words, what happened, my brothers and sisters, <coughs> Elijah was telling the king of Israel where not to go. And one of Benadad's servants went and told him, well, it ain't none of us that's telling. Our promise is not. <laughs> it, 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 it's this cat right. that, that, that's, that, that's down there somewhere that, 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 that's telling the king of Israel Everything you say, even in this room. Amen. My brothers and sisters, before you speak it in the atmosphere, you better pray to God first. Amen. Amen. Because his plans may not be your plans. Amen. And, 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 and when you say that plan, God might be saying, you know what, I had somebody pray about that same thing. Thank you for that idea. And give it to them. Amen. Pray about it before you do anything, my brothers and sisters. <clears throat> so continuing on, we, we, we see that Benadad sent spies to find Elijah. Uh -huh. He sent horses and chariots to Dothan. Mm -hmm. Now, brothers and sisters, I ain't talking about Dothan, Alabama. Mm -hmm. I don't want y'all to get back and say that. That, 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 that preacher at um, Stuart Temple today talking about Elijah was in Dothan, Alabama, y'all. <laughs> it's not Dothan, Alabama. It's Dothan that's about 12 miles outside of Syria. Mm -hmm. Matter, matter of fact, it's the same Dothan that Joshua got sold into slavery. Uh -huh. That Dothan. Yeah. So don't go to Alabama looking for Elijah. Because yeah. <laughs> you might not find him. Yeah. All right. <laughs> so he sent the spies out, and the spies came back and told him he was in Dothan. So he sent out horses and chariots to surround the city. Now, this may look like a lot of people for such a small person. But my brothers and sisters, let me tell you, the devil will send everything he has yes, yes. to keep you from God. Yes. Yes. He will send people to surround you, that way you won't see your blessing. Yes. He will send people to surround you that you won't see the favor in God. Yes. He will send people to surround you to cast fear in you yes. and make you fall to your knees. Oh, okay. My brothers and sisters, if we look at this servant here, we see he got up that morning and when he got up, all he saw was he was surrounded. Mm -hmm. He looked to the left, didn't see but horses and chariots. Well, okay. He looked to the right, didn't see but horses and chariots. All right. He looked behind him and then see but horses and chariots. Amen. So immediately he ran to Elijah and said, Alas, my master. And I'm paraphrasing him. At last, my master, but what is we going to do? <laughs> I, I, I understand, Elijah, you, you just told Naaman to go dip himself in the river seven times. Mm -hmm. I, I know you did that because I, I, I was there watching. Amen. I, 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 I know you cast the wood in the river yeah. to pull up the axe yeah. head that I just lost. Yeah. Okay. I, I, I know you did that. Yeah. I, I, I know God is your ace boom coon. Amen. And y'all on first name basis. Right. And you got him on speed. 
feet down, Amen. but they got us around And I don't know what we is going to do. Well, my brothers and sisters, let me just take a second right here to tell you that word, but. Mm. Let, let me focus on that word, but, for a second. And I, I think I was paying attention, Miss Mandarin, English classes. But I wasn't trying to sneak to your band room. Amen. <laughs> but but is a conjunction. Amen. It contradicts everything that you said yes. before. Amen. In other words, my brothers and sisters, that but nothing voids everything before. Uh -huh. yeah. Can I tell you, Stuart Temple, our problem is we got our butt in the wrong place. Amen. Amen. If you don't know what I'm talking about, let me put it this way. Lord, I know you got me through my last situation, but this one's bigger. Lord, I, I know you healed me from my flu, but this is cancer. Lord, Lord, Lord I, I know you're a doctor in the sick room, but this is heart surgery. Lord, I know you're a lawyer in the courtroom, but this is drug charge. Lord, I know you supply all my wants and needs, but my money is funny and the bills are not laughing. Amen. Oh my God. Lord, I know you don't want me to go through what I'm going through with this man, but any piece of man is better than no man at all. Lord, I, I know you say love your neighbor, but you know I can't stand that. Yeah. 
situation is, yes, uh, no yes. matter uh, what your circumstances, yes. the devil may have you surrounded, uh, but God. Uh, right now, and just in case I never see you again, just in case I don't come back to preach to you no more, I think the songwriter said it best, I've had some weary days, I've had some good days, I've had some hills to climb, but when I think about it, I'm glad you asked, because my Jesus went to the cross for me. He went to the cross knowing one day he'd have to come back and save a wretch like me. He knew one day he'd have a child that was being a little obnoxious. He knew one day he'd have a child that decided to jump on the bike of a car and ride to from the field house, from, from, from the school to the field house on King Street and fall off. Get up again when 